oftentimes you're going to be debating um, about policies that have to do, deal with money or you're going to be putting together some type of budget that is going to reflect your values and it's all going to be about money. And all of that is can be really important because I would argue that right now, and you see in the slide right now, we see that in the black community, $1 circulates only six hours or compared to let's say in the Asian American community where $1 circulates for 30 days. And that that is the culmination actually of many, many years and generations of both policies and budgets that don't necessarily reflect an equitable view. And that's, and that's why we have something called the community wealth gap. Um, can you go to the next slide? There was actually a study that just came out a couple months ago um, from Northwestern University, and it actually looked at income and wealth of Black and Hispanic community families versus white families. And just on the community, on the income side, it looked at how Black families only have 47 cents for every dollar of income the white families have, and for Hispanic families, it's only 48 cents. And while income is awesome, but income only feeds my stomach, right? What I'm really interested in, what we all should be really interested in is wealth, because wealth is what feeds our minds. When you look at wealth, the disparity is even more disgusting. Black families only have one sense of the wealth that white, family ha white families have for every of their $1. Hispanic families only have a cents compared to, um, or relative to $1 of wealth the white families have.